What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Slim, and welcome to my first episode of Project Zomboid 100 Days or Bust. This series is going to act as a catalog of me, a complete noob to this game, with a whopping 14 hours total, and that's purely just trying to set up the, uh, the recording software. So, this is going to act as a catalog of me trying to reach 100 days, which is my goal, with one single character. And, uh... I'm going to keep restarting until I get there. So without further ado, let's uh, create this first character. Uh, I am going to be playing on Sandbox with a few tweak settings. Ooh. You know, I honestly don't know what the best place is for a uh, beginner. I'm just going to go ahead and stick with a uh, bull draw. Let's see. I'm going to keep uh, all this normal for the most part. Go down to loot rarity. And uh, change everything to extremely rare, just for shits and giggles. And we are going to go ahead and change... Where is it at? I don't like the fact that zombies respawn. So, hopefully that is the setting that changes that. Oh, and I am going to change this to sometimes. Alright, and for my occupation, I'm going to go ahead and choose burglar because i like the idea of being sneaky and sneaking around the zombies because the less altercations we get in i believe that's going to prolong our life and get us quicker to the goal of 100 days so let's see God. from the few things i read up on this game i believe uh going underweight you can eat your way back to being like normal weight so i'm gonna go ahead and choose that let's see what else we got here high thirst i don't really know what i'm picking let's see i'm gonna go smoker uh disorganized go weak stomach and slow reader because we can speed up time. Former scout. Uh, gymnast. Resilient. Ooh. Actually, I'm going to take away gymnast and replace that with graceful and inconspicuous. And then we're going to go ahead and finish this off with outdoorsman. We'll go cat's eyes. And I think that's it. Alrighty. Let's get right into it. Ooh. Let's see what we got on the random. Vito Vega. Hell yeah. Alrighty. Ah. Nothing like a room temperature Coca Cola. Alright, let's get this out of the way. I don't need to know how to play. Figure it out myself. Alrighty, so it looks like real quiet. It's good. Looks like we spawn into just a real small house. Two, three bedroom. Oh, two bed, one bath. Okay. Very nice. TV's going. Let's see. I don't know if turning down the volume does anything really, but, you know, I'd go ahead and assume so. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. Okay. Making our way over to the kitchen. Empty cooking pot. Got in these cupboards. Ooh, kitchen knife. Take that. Ooh, okay. Sugar, cereal, anything in the fridge, no, okay, fingerless gloves, oh we're about to be the coolest kid on the playground. 
And some baggy jeans, okay. Oh shit, there was something in there. Okay. Oh wow. Oh, I hear something rummaging around. I don't know if that's just loose pipes or... Oh man. Oh. Oh, we got bodies outside. This is... I hope that's just a static spawn and not something real. Wait. Did something just rattle on a door? Oh man, I think I'm just freaking out. This is getting spooky. Okay. I think I need to go ahead and arm myself. Where's that knife? Uh, put primary. Where? Alright, there we go. At least now our hands won't get bloody. At least most of our fa hands. Oh, whoa. Okay, yeah, they were sleeping. Oh, that was quick. Okay. They got on them. Uh, long sleeve sneaker socks. Let me get into this little side room. Got in the storage closet. A uh, metal bar. Okay, I think that's going to be better than our knife. Because I think our knife can be used for uh, other things. Okay, I think I want to move away from... Ooh. Okay. Bunch of small houses over there where we got a bunch of zombies. I think our safest plan of action will be moving through the woods. Hopefully. To this bigger house over here. I'll come back for that shotgun eventually. What's a button to hop over? Okay, there we go. E. Oh. Bunch of zombies to our right. I don't know if they saw me. Are they just fumbling around? Oh, don't come this way. Oh, I think that one saw me. Shit. Uh. Yep. Okay, there we go. That one's taken care of. Uh, Louisville map. If I am correct, that is nowhere near where I want to go right now. You can go and keep all your little shenanigans to yourself. Some busted up cars. Shed. I don't want to go nowhere near that shed. Front door is locked. Try a window. Oh, no, let me close the window. There we go. Uh, oh, I'm going to go ahead and say that's for the car outside. That is awesome. Okay, so that's volume one. That... That teaches me a recipe. I'm gonna go ahead and read that before I leave this house. Let's see. Ooh, that has better scratch resistance. Okay, I'll take that. Briefcase. I don't think it's got anything inside of it. A gun case with looks like just ammo. 
I will take that pen though for the map. Start marking off these houses. Let's see. Working our way towards the kitchen. Ooh, a radish. I'll go ahead and take that since it's fresh. I'll leave all this and leave a note for it. I don't want to be too encumbered as we go. Ooh, painkillers. I want to keep any medicine on me, just in case. That looks like another... Oh, yeah, there's a door right here. Third the door. Let's see what we got in here. A belt. Oh, I can't equip the belt, okay. Go ahead and take this time to eat that radish. Because I believe since we're severely underweight, if we like calorie load ourselves, it should help with that. I could just be talking out of my ass right now. I really have no clue. Okay, there we go. Now we're really starting to look like a burglar. This, uh, this mohawk's kind of... I don't know, it's kind of throwing it off for me. When you get this man a hat. Go ahead and cure our thirst. Let's see, now we get to play the guessing game. Is it the red one? Or is it the other one? Oh, empty bottle, okay. Take that back inside. Okay, let's see. Uh, ooh, a Moldra map. That probably will come in pretty handy, given that's where we are. Let's check. And it starts to rain. Oh, wow. Besides gas and two brakes, this car is doing pretty good. Wow. I have to mark this down. Come back to this later. I don't even want to risk them seeing me. Okay. Let me go back inside, wash out that water bottle. Lock that door. Alright, there's that. Uh, Let's go ahead and read this magazine. Get it out the way. Already read. So I think because it's already read, I can go ahead and drop it. So check out this map. Oh, that is not what I was expecting. Okay. Yep. Yep, that that's definitely a map. I have no clue where I'm at though. What the hell is that noise? Oh, that is a terrifying noise, whatever it is. Uh, 
All right, think. Think, think, think. Think, Slim. Think. All right. I think I'm going to go ahead and... Okay, so they're migrating north. I'm going to see what's going on. Ooh, this looks like a gas station. Or some type of small commercial complex. I'm going to work my way over there slowly. I think that zombie spotted me. Yep. Okay, he's definitely going to need to get the, uh, the, old, the old pipe. Alright, pipe administered. Yeah, that's another body on the floor that I do not trust. Okay, now they're dead. Ooh, good find. Watch. And we'll at least be able to tell the time. I know there's ones that can tell the date. I'd really like to get one of those. Oh, shit. Okay, so that, that's a laundry, laundry mat. Yep. I don't need new clothes. Okay, away from that area too. Maybe hopefully I can get to the shed now. Because it looks like most of that horde went that way. Okay, now there's still two. I don't know if I want to risk it. Oh, shit. I think he totally saw me. Oh, I might have just got myself into a fucking pickle. Oh no. Club hammer, a wrench, a light bulb, some rope, safety goggles. Hell yeah, where are the safety goggles? Propane torch. I think all this stuff's a little bit out of my out of my reach for right now. Alrighty, I think as much as I'd love to stay here and wait for him to run away, I'd hate to stay here and more come and just gather outside this door and I starve to death. So uh Oh, and look at that. He was never even over here. Cool. He just hopped the fence because he was a curious little dude. Okay. That being said, let's see. That requires a key. I'm going to head back over to our starting house. And I'm going to see about possibly going up and around the corner. If not, there's a lot of zombies here. Before nightfall, we might hop in the car and just dip a scoozy. I don't know where we're going to go. Hopefully somewhere less populated, maybe a less residential area. Why am I panicking? Oh, uh, my dude probably needs a cigarette. That's probably what's up. Alright, back inside. Let's go ahead and get ourselves situated on this map. We have... Those two have been done. Cool. Oh, okay. There we go. So now that map from earlier is making a lot more sense. 
All right, so if I was to take the car, I mean, we're in a... Goodness, I don't know where a good spot would be. I don't know what yellow means. I mean, maybe this strip right here. Hmm. I guess this is just going to be one of those moments where uh, I learned something out of it. Goodness. Crossing the street's going to be painful. Going up the street's going to be painful. And going through the woods, I have no eyes on anything. Let's see. Let's just keep slowly head up this way. Maybe we can hit this before nightfall. Hopefully we don't attract those guys from that backyard. I didn't even think about that. Hey, this is a big two-story house too. This is this is bound to have something nice. Oh no, they're coming out of the woods. Ooh, ooh, that was a close call. I saw that little animation. She went to go fight. Me. Oh, shit. Alright, there we go. There we go. Ooh. That was a close call. I hate being in the wide open. Grab that. Holy. Looped earrings, gold ring, belly button ring. Goodness, got all the piercings. Oh. It's the Fool Mart. You know what? We might not be taking that car. Anyways, okay. Cool. Things are looking up. The tin can, garbage bag. Oh man, more dead bodies just everywhere. Oh, whoa, that is... Oh, that's more than a dead body. Oh, that's... That's picked clean. Oh, God. Holy moly. Wowzers. Okay. Maybe maybe that's good. Maybe all the zombies are full in this area. They've already eaten. And they don't want none of me. I start peeking at anything. Let's go ahead and do a quick clear of the house. No blinds downstairs. Upstairs. Okay. I got a really nice feeling about this house. This might be our uh, temporary place of refuge. Alright. So that is the case. I don't know why I opened that. We're going to go ahead and start by removing all the curtains upstairs. I want to put them downstairs.
right now let's go ahead and see what we got cooking peas steak awesome uh i think i'm gonna need like a pan or something to cook that i've never actually done any cooking Ooh, okay uh, at least we got the peas though not a lot of food in this house, but I can go back and grab the ones from the previous houses. Okay, here we go. Uh, volume three of the hunters. Uh, electrician volume one. Word tourist magazines. Sweet, sweet. Nothing in this bathroom. Let's see what's going on. Wait, is that a cooking pot down there? I wonder if I can make some good soup with that steak. Steak and pea soup. Oh, an electric guitar. Okay. Use that as a weapon. MSR 700 rifle. Huh. No ammo with it, though, but... Huh. That's a gun. Oh, and a pencil. I'll go ahead and add that to the collection of drawn utensils. Oh, oh. See, there was nothing in here. And we can jump out onto the roof, so that's pretty cool. I'm pretty sure we can also use like rope to uh to get down. Foraging volume two. Box of nine millimeter. Oh, a little pistol. Round neck sweater. We already got a cool sweater going. Alrighty, cool. It is what time? Seven ten. So let's see. Okay, so apparently with the water bottles, as you get thirsty, your character will drink the water that's already in your inventory as long as you have it inside of a... Uh... Oh, another water bottle too, as long as you have it inside of like a bottle or I don't know what else is can hold water in this game, probably like cans and stuff. So that's pretty cool. Where are they at? No. Oh, scary. Just come on in. Don't break my window. Don't be an asshole. Oh, what rude neighbors in this area. Didn't even think about trying the door. Just immediately jumped. Straight to the window. All right, let's go ahead and fix this situation. Let's just drop that right back there. Hopefully that didn't, I don't know, entice more of them to come forward. I don't think I was too loud. Do I have any food on me? Let's go ahead and eat this cereal. Materials good. And let's go ahead and we had a crossword puzzle in here. If I'm correct. Let's see. Yeah, word search magazine. Okay. I believe if I read this, it's gonna make my anxious level go down.
that did not do anything. He is stressed to high hell. Alright, but it's getting late. Hopefully he's not too stressed to go to sleep. Come up here and sleep in the room with the gun. I can't lock these top doors. Okay. Alrighty, so. Thank you all for tuning in to the first episode of 100 Days of Bust. I'm Slim. Any comments will be appreciated. Any pointers, tips, anything like that. And uh, I hope to see you on the next episode. Have a good one.